The rapid development of large-scale solar projects has become one of the major societal successes of our time. However, future adoption could be limited by shortage of suitable land as solar generation starts to compete with food production. To help resolve this conflict, Sunseed and Kanoda Energy, in partnership with German Development Cooperation, and in collaboration with local farmers, have set up an agrivoltaics facility where solar generation is co-located with crop cultivation on the same piece of land. This 1.4 MW agrivoltaics farm on 5 acres of land is part of a bigger solar project located in the Marathwada region of Maharashtra in western India. The highlight of the project is the 1.5 acre, 4 meters elevated system integrated with a shade net house growing trellising vegetables, capsicum, cherry tomatoes, cucumbers, and beetle leaves, and shade-loving flowers roses, hibiscus, chrysanthemums and tuberose. All these crops are also being grown in an open area as a control environment. The innovative mounting structure uses Sunseed's tensioned cable systems having the same robust design concepts as in suspension bridges. The easy-to-install and lightweight system is about 25% less expensive than conventional structures. The structures also incorporate several features that enable advanced agriculture, mechanisms for retractable shade nets, trellises for crop support, and foggers for temperature control. The shade nets can be retracted in just a few minutes based on the radiation intensity and temperature profile, which are monitored via weather stations to provide the optimal growing environment. In addition to the shade house, systems with lower elevations of 1.25 meters and 1.75 meters have also been installed which incur only marginally higher capital costs than conventional solar projects. These sections will be growing turmeric, marigolds, melons, leafy greens and Ayurvedic herbs. Initially, the land at the site was hard, clay, lumpy, and full of weeds, making it tough to prepare the land below the panels. Many tractors with different farm implements were used to prepare the soil and create granular beds ready for cultivation. Apart from helping enhance crop yields, the shade house is designed to increase power generation as well. The higher albedo of the system due to the highly reflective shade nets and mulches, along with the higher elevation and greater distance between rows of panels, is expected to double the bifacial gain. Separately, the cooling of the panels due to the evapotranspiration is expected to increase panel efficiency during the dry months. In a water-stressed region, it was imperative to have an efficient irrigation strategy. Water is being pumped from a well via a solar pump that connects to a drip irrigation network which is triggered based on soil moisture sensors installed in each crop section. The reduced evapotranspiration due to the shade is expected to result in additional savings of 30 to 40 percent. Rainwater will be harvested via a drainage network aided by trenches below panel edges and gradation of the land such that the water flows to the natural drains at the periphery where it gets stored via a check dam. The solar panels are being cleaned via automatic cleaning robots which are shifted from one row to another via an elevated walkway and supplemented by occasional water cleaning. The project is set up with IoT-based instrumentation to enable extensive R&D. This includes development of photosynthesis response curves and measurement of temperature profiles for simulating crops yields and accurate bifacial gain analysis using spectroradiometers and albedometers. The research will help develop crop-specific technologies to create commercially viable and bankable projects. Agrivoltaics can have a profound impact creating integrated, sustainable, and climate-resilient food water energy systems. Agrivoltaics can increase crop and energy yields while reducing the use of land and water, helping form a win-win partnership between solar developers and farmers. Come. Join us in this journey as we discover new facets of the fascinating world of agrivoltaics.